Imagine unearthing a cinematic treasure that's been lost to the sands of time. That's the quest we're on today as we dive into the mystery of Buster Keaton's lost film, Blade Buster. A sequel to his masterpiece, The General, this film depicted Keaton's character going insane, murdering his love interest from The General. But after its completion in the late 1920s, Blade Buster mysteriously disappeared. Why did such a promising film vanish? The film was so bleak that it horrified the initial test audiences and studio executives. Concerned about its reception, the studio decided to shelve Blade Buster. And over the decades, all copies seemed to have been lost. Or were they? Fast forward to today and Blade Buster has become a holy grail for film buffs and historians. Every so often a clue surfaces, a poster, a clip of lost footage, a witness account, reigniting the hopes that somewhere out there, a copy still exists. Why does this matter? Rediscovering Blade Buster isn't just about filling a gap in film history. It's about reclaiming a piece of Buster Keaton's legacy, understanding his evolution as an artist, and perhaps even gaining new insights into the silent film era. So grab your detective hats, folks, as we embark on this cinematic quest. Who knows? Maybe together, we'll be part of uncovering one of the greatest mysteries in film history. Stay tuned. It's about to get sweaty.
Live to shoot another day.